Sometimes you're not very satisfied in a fast-paced shooter or even a battle royal game. You want to slow things down and travel to another world. In those situations, the best thing you can do is play some tried and true adventure games. Hey everyone, I'm Paul. And today on Android Tools, we're going to be counting down our top picks for the 10 best adventure games for your Android and iOS device. But before we start the video, let me introduce you to today's sponsor, Inky Doodle. Inky Doodle is a casual game like Kick the Buddy, but the concept is somewhat different. Here, you can create your own character and customize its shape, size, and color, after which you can smash it in order to release the delicious candy within. Clicking on these candies will provide you with points and help you to unlock and upgrade resources. The game has realistic soft body physics and can convert any drawing into a destructible object full of candy. There are dozens of exciting research items, challenging missions, and powerful unlockable tools, such as swords, lasers, and bombs, which make this game both very creative and very exciting. Starting at number 10, we have Best Luck. Best Luck is an interactive adventure for mobile built on a rich storyline. The game is designed to tell you a lot of different and mystical stories with amazing and unique endings. In this game, you will explore the interactive world as the main character and solve challenging puzzles. Help the main character to reveal the secret of his dreams and find out that he wants a girl who dreams of him every night and where she came from. Navigate through beautifully illustrated scenes of the game and find the items you need to help solve puzzles. Overall, this is a stunning, fully interactive, story-driven adventure experience. Moving on to number 9, we have Father and Son. This is a 2D graphic adventure that tells the story of a son and his deceased father. Sadly, Michael, the son, never really had a connection with Francisco, the father, because Francisco dedicated his entire life to his job at the National Archaeological Museum of Naples. After his father's death, Michael decides to try to get to know his father through his work. In order to move your character through the setting, you just need to tap the sides of the screen. If you want to interact with any element in the setting, you just have to click the buttons that pop up on the screen. Michael's actions are pretty varied, from sitting down and having coffee to talking to another person or even drawing. Breaking into number 8, we have Typo Man. Typo Man is an action and adventure game that challenges you to help a character that's made up of letters while he explores different platforms. To do so, you need to make up different words with the letters that you stumble upon during your adventure. Visuals in Typo Man are really well designed, which is why you'll be easily submerged inside the setting where you'll find light and shadows alike. Controls are very basic, and you just have to tap on the virtual D-pad located on the left side of the screen. Then, just tap on the different elements to solve the puzzles on the screen. If you want to jump, then tap on the action button to thrust your character vertically. Next up at number 7, we have Ink, Mountains and Mystery. This is the second part of the indie game from the developers of The Beautiful Dream. In this game with horizontal scrolling, your main task is the controls of the main character, who wants to get to the top of the mountain. Plunge into the unique and fabulous world of the game, where you'll travel through three-dimensional locations and perform numerous missions and tasks of the game. The game will delight players by bypassing the unique artistic concept of the exciting story of the protagonist. The art and animation are flawlessly beautiful and sceneries breathtaking. The stories are romantic and somewhat nostalgic. Spend your free time playing this game and enjoy the unique storyline. Moving on to number 6, we have Z Shelter Survival. This is another adventure zombie survival with crafting, building as well as fighting the dead and other survivors. Earth was a great place to live, but suddenly there is an outbreak of an unknown virus that began to spread rapidly through the world. Most people have turned into brutal zombies, and the remaining desperately fight for existence. The main character will face many dangers and threats such as hunger, thirst, cold, the dead, other survivors, etc., which you will help him overcome. Start by searching for supplies, food, wood, stone, and other materials you will need to build a safe haven and craft items. Moving on to number 5, we have Lucid Dream Adventure. Lucid Dream is a great quest of classic mechanics. Gamers are offered a fascinating adventure story of a cute girl whose life is filled with worries and worries about her mother. To find a solution to the problem, she goes on a journey through a scary and frightening maze, where it is waiting for finds, unexpected discoveries, as well as meetings with residents of other worlds, that they would talk to her, help her, and show her the right way. Beautiful graphics, poignant story, long durations, puzzles, mini-games, and much more will not leave fans of the genre indifferent. Next up at number 4, we have Oddmar, 
Oddmar is an incredible adventure platformer for mobile based on Scandinavian mythology. Here, you have to play for the main character, a Viking named Oddmar. The game's story takes place at a time when the forest fairy gives Oddmar a magic mushroom to eat, which gives him magical powers. More than 24 fascinating levels await you full of adventure, riddles, and puzzles, all of them based on real laws of physics that do the game even more justice. Also, you are awaited by fights with sets of fantastic beings, and at the end of each level, the boss, who will become for you the real problem. You will have access to several different types of attacking and defensive magical abilities. Coming in at number 3, we have The Wolf Among Us. This is a graphic adventure game structured in episodes, developed by Telltale Games and based on the comic book fables by Bill Willingham, winner of more than a dozen international prizes. In the game, you play the role of Bigby Wolf, the tough sheriff of Fabletown. As in other Telltale games, you can move your character freely through the settings and interact with different elements, although the most important thing will be the dialogue and the resulting consequences of your actions. One of the new things in this game is that different decisions won't just change the course of the story, but also the time at which the events take place. Next up at number 2 we have Unknown Fate. Unknown Fate is a single-player puzzle adventure game where you will help Richard to get to the truth. The plot of the game begins with the fact that the main character woke up in an unknown world. He has no memories of the past and how he ended up here. He also does not know anything. Now your main task will be able to find out the truth and defeat all the enemies. Solve challenging puzzles, travel through a fantasy world, and collect fragments of Richard's lost memories. The game will delight players with an exciting story of searching for various items. And finally at number 1 we have Life is Strange. Life is Strange is another graphic adventure developed by Telltale Games, creators of The Wolf Among Us. Follow along as you take on the life of the talented young Maxine, a high school student who's recently discovered her budding superpower going back in time to change the course of events. Game systems in this game are practically identical to any of the other titles by Telltale Games. The main appeal is that you can go back in time to rewind and fix any poor decision making of the past, and thereby rectifying your mistakes to make better choices. At any point, you can always go back and explore alternative routes and storylines within the game. So that's it guys. If you found this video interesting, then leave a like and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. Once again, I'm Paul. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.